What's up guys, it's one third of the sexiest looking guys on YouTube. I'm not super hyped for this video due to the fact that I know my mom is going to see this and she's probably going to be upset that I am releasing it. But this is the story on the time I accidentally hit my mom in the face. Um, not super happy about it, but I was very angry and I'm pretty sure she caught me in the morning and she's not a morning person, I'm not a morning person. And my brother's not a morning person. Probably due to the fact that we're all three Virgos. Um, so that might not have helped. But it was early morning and we were getting up to go to school. Keep in mind, I used to live out by Homestead and I used to go to Northup. So that's like a 45 minute drive every single day. Early in the morning. So she'll get up. She'll be super angry. And I think, I'm pretty sure I had like a bad dream or something to be honest. And I was just really upset. Because I, like I probably like I probably had a dream where I like ended up losing my brother and I don't like having those dreams because that really upsets me because that's my that's my homie right there my ninja and we were driving and every single morning she like complains she's like I can't believe this I'm sick and tired of taking you guys why don't you just go to the other school I'm like ma you're the only one that has the power to change what school we go to and she just kept like blah 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 every single morning and every single morning it would just I would get more angry and angry and it was a night where my brother's uh one of my brother's friends stayed too so like it was another witness and basically she like she was she was like freaking and oh and the night before the night before we had got into it and because like she kept like telling me like yeah she's my mom she gets to tell me what to do but like she knew I was already upset and she kept making me do other things and like she was like agging on basically and it was like oh you forgot this oh come back and do this like I'll make it halfway up the stairs and she's like oh why don't you come downstairs and do the dishes now I'm like ma I just cleaned the entire freaking house because you told me to and I'm already upset and I was just like I started walking upstairs and I was just like I I'm done bro I'm not cleaning another thing like I'm going to my room I'm done for the night and she was just like you'll do whatever I say and I was like I'm going to my room and that's what I say <laughs> I really don't like come at people like that but like she was agging me on and I I already have bad enough anger issues as it is like if you guys see the videos where I show my hands like my my hands are messed up like I have cuts and scars and and like my knuckles are kind of like misshapen because I've broken them and I, I punch things when I get angry because I don't want to punch people to because I don't like hurt people a whole lot either but I was just like yo I'm done I'm not coming back down these stairs and she's like she's like yes you are come in here and sweep the kitchen I was like I already sweep this she's like you didn't do good enough and I was like I'm not doing it I don't care so I started walking up the stairs and she got she got off the couch and I like, started coming after me and keep in mind like you tried mom I'm fast as fudge guys she didn't catch me at all. I, I was in my room and I locked the door and everything and she tried to like bust in. I was like, Ma, you're like a five foot midget. Don't even try, dude. Like, don't even try. Like, you will not do it. And it made me laugh and she heard me laugh. And that made her even more angry because I laughed at her. She's like, oh, you wanna laugh? You think this is funny? You're not, uh, I'm confiscating everything. And this, this was a time where I was very skinny. I, I had a whole lot of like protein powder and stuff like that. And she took it and like dumped it down the toilet and the the, the smell was so strong I could smell it all the way up in my room. That's how strong it was. And I, my room's like all the way upstairs to the left, all the way in the back of the hall. And then you're, the bathroom is downstairs in the second living room. Cause we had a pretty nice house at this time. It's Homestead. You guys, anybody that lives in Fort Wayne knows that Homestead people kind of have pretty good houses, whatever. And so that that happened and she called the cops on me yeah she called the cops on me because like i was refusing and i guess i was being a disobedient child that's why my mom's gonna get angry at me because like in a way like it was stupid they couldn't do anything to me anyway i'm getting off topic it was dumb and i was already upset with her so we get to go into school and she was just like she was so she was upset with me too because i'm pretty sure i was like i hate you and she was like i hate you too and it made me cry I was like, yo, my mom just said she hates me. And so I wrote her a letter 
And I was like, yo, I'm sorry and all that stuff. But it didn't make it better because she was still being a meanie to me the next day. And we were driving and she just kept like talking and talking and talking. And I was like, mom, shut up. And I was like, oh, I just told my mom to shut up. And my friend, well, my brother's friend was in the back and he was like, oh, freaking doing the ag on stuff. He's like, oh, I was like, you shut up too, bro. You trying to cause... And I cussed, like, you trying to, you trying to start the S word. And my brother, he was just like, he was like half asleep. So he really didn't care. Or, I mean, I didn't really care to look at his expression because I was so freaking pissed. And my mom, she like, she raised her hand at me to like backhand me. And she, she had backhanded me before when I was younger and like a little bit uh, later on in life too. She, and I, I busted my lip because she had a ring. And that was the first thing that popped in my mind when she raised her hand up at me. Man, I stuttered a whole lot. I'm sorry. That was the first thing that popped in my mind when she raised her hand at me. It was like, yo, I remember getting hit before. I'm not going to let it happen. And my first instinct was to, like, when somebody swings at you, your instinct is to, like, block it and hit them back. Stuff like that. And I was just like, I shoved I shoved the, her hand away because she tried to, like, backhand me. Jesus. Accidentally turned this video into story gets violent turned ER and stuff because the light will hit me in the face But she rose her hand at me like that and I, I like I caught it and like threw it to the side um, And like I went to go hit her back and Like I got like this close like I mean like I probably grazed her and I was like I felt that I had touched her. I mean I may not have like boop 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 hit her but I felt that I had touched her and it was in an angry way. An angry, angry way. Why did I say it so weird like that? It was in an, in an angry way. And my mom like pulled the car over instantly. She said, she whipped it. She basically invented the watch me whip because she whipped it so hard, man. And she was just like, she started smacking me, not my face because I was like, she started hitting me in my side. I was like, don't you ever touch me again like that. And She's like, don't you ever raise your hand at me? And I made my mom flinch too, so you're not supposed to make your parents flinch. And I made her flinch and she was like, I should never have to fear my kid or stuff like that. And she was like, she was like, I may not be able to beat you, but I will find a baseball bat and take you out. She always says that like just randomly sometimes too. I feel like she has short person syndrome. Mom, sorry about that. But randomly one day she was just like, I you know I can take you out. Luke. I was like, okay, mom. She's like, even if I can't, I'll find a baseball bat and take your knees out or something. I was like, why the freak did you just turn into a monster freaking mafia? Italian mafia person, yo, take him out. Like, Benny hit him with the bat. It's like, dang, ma, chill out. And so we ended up, she still ended up taking us to school, but like, the rest of my day sucked. And then I had to go to football practice. And then she had to pick me up, which means I had to see her again. <sighs> Sorry, mom. And like, from the rest of the day on, like, I think my mom and me were cool. I can't remember if we ended up being okay from, like, that, from that on. Because, like, we kind of came to, like, an understanding in the car. Like, yo, I'm sorry. I said I hate you and stuff like that. And so I think I think we ended up being okay for the rest of the day, to be honest. But, man, it was, like, just thinking about it, it, like, makes my heart race. Because I remember the uh, the adrenaline that I felt and the emotions that were running through my mind at the time and they were just like so angry and I was like yo I could for real kill this person right now that's how angry I was my I almost killed you to be honest sorry yeah my mom's for real gonna kill me over this guys so you guys better like and comment and subscribe because I'm not gonna be able to make any more videos when she sees this I'm definitely gonna die so I'm dying for you guys though but I just want to say Thank you to God every single day because without him, none of this would be able to be possible. We wouldn't be able to bring you guys content, make you guys laugh, and maybe even change your guys' day a little bit. Without him, there's nothing. Through all things grace is possible. If you guys want any prayers done, put them in the comments below. We'll put you in our prayer group. And make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. Hit us up on our social media. Let us know about videos you guys want to see from us. And don't be afraid to ask us questions. Like, like when we do the Q and A's and stuff, give us some hardcore ask actual questions. Uh, 
I did not cuss. I meant I was saying actual. Give us some actual hardcore questions because like no no question is off limits. I love you guys. Peace and I'm out.